Chika Unigwe, and I'm still reading Ogadima by Okamaka Odisakwe. Ah, the girl can write, Shao. Okamaka can write. The book is so compelling that I have been taking it everywhere with me. I take it to the bathroom. Um, I take it to the backyard when I'm outside. I take it to, I bring it to the dining table, even though I shouldn't show. But um, where, where I am now in the book is um, really triggering for me. Triggering because Ogadima's naivety is so familiar. It's so familiar because I was that naive at her age, right? Um, fortunately for me, my naivety didn't threaten to open my life in the way that Ogadima's is um, threatening to open hers at the moment, completely derail her plans. And I am mad. I'm mad at her father who makes it difficult for her to talk to him. And I'm mad at the man who is directly responsible for the mess that her life is at the moment. And um, it's really upsetting because I do know that such men exist. And I do know that in Nigeria especially, they go scot-free. Um, I take solace in the fact that the title of this book is Ogadema or everything will be all right. Don't you worry about a thing, you know. Um, so I'm not, good. I'm not worried. I know that Ogadema is going to pick up herself and um, make something of her life. And I'm here for the journey. You, don't be unfortunate. <laughs> Download one read. I read Ogadima. Thank me later. Find me, find me, find me.